Hello everyone, as a lot of you may know, the Tamagotchi Uni is coming soon. We are all so excited about this and I've gotten so many requests to talk about it. It's actually currently the 14th of July, so it's still one day away from the release of the Tamagotchi Uni. If you don't know what the Tamagotchi Uni is, it is Bandai's newest Tamagotchi release and this is one of the most innovative and different Tamagotchi Bandai has done to date. All I know is it's going to be kind of like the Tamagotchi Smart where it works as a smartwatch as well as a virtual pet. It's similar in that sense but then obviously the content is completely different. The shell design and the appearance is also completely different and the best part is it comes in many different languages and I think the Tamagotchi Uni has gotten a lot of interest and has been so hyped up because of the new list of language selections it has incorporated into the toy. Bandai has currently announced two different colors for the Tamagotchi Uni. I've already pre-ordered the pink one. I ordered that through my friend in the US but I know that there is also a Japanese version which is actually the same toy. The only difference is the packaging is a lot smaller, it's more compact. I personally prefer the Japanese version more just because it's more storage friendly. So yeah, I ordered a pink Tamagotchi Uni. I really do also want to order a Japanese version and I want to get the purple one so that I have, you know, both of them. That's what I'm going to do today. It's one day before release and I want to show you guys how I order the Tamagotchi Uni all the way from Japan via Bayi. Bayi is a massive Japanese shopping proxy service. They are a service I've used for many many years. I've been using them since 2015 and I buy a lot of my Tamagotchis in my collection through Bayi. I've talked about Bayi in my other collection videos before but I've never really shown you kind of like a real-time shopping experience through Bayi and that's what I want to do today. I want to show you guys how I order the Tamagotchi Tamagotchi Uni through Bayi and just want to show you guys how easy and simple the process is. I live all the way in Western Australia that's super far away from Japan and shipping things here is never cheap. The best thing about using a shopping proxy like Bayi is that because it's a shopping proxy it doesn't limit you to just buying the one item from a store. You can buy from many different stores in Japan. Everything will be shipped to the Bayi warehouse and then from there they can consolidate all your packages in one and ship that to you. That saves you a lot of time and money and I just really recommend you guys trying it out if you live outside of Japan and wish to get some of these collectible items. This will make your life a lot easier. You can actually shop like a Japanese local. Make sure you check Bayi out and if you're unsure of how it works, I'm going to show you how it's all done. Let's order the Tamagotchi Uni together. First thing you want to do, hop over to the Bayi website. Bayi website itself will have direct links to many Japanese shopping platforms. These direct links are very helpful in helping me find and discover shops that I can shop from. For today's Tamagotchi Uni purchase, I'll be using Rakuten. So on the Rakuten search engine, type in Tamagotchi Uni. Once you hit search, you'll be shown to many different listings. You'll also see that the prices have been converted to your local currency for you, which is very helpful. Once you find the listing you want to purchase, click add to shopping cart. From the shopping cart, click proceed to order page for the item you want to pay for, which in this case is the Tamagotchi Uni. Once you've reached a checkout page, decide whether you want to purchase an insurance plan for your package. You can also check the fee breakdown on the bottom and once everything is okay, simply click the pay. So it's only been an hour and a half and Bai has already helped me purchase my item. You'll get this confirmation email just stating what they helped you buy with the funds that you gave them. The next step is to wait for your item to reach Bai's warehouse. This process can take up to two weeks but from my own experience, most sellers ship quite quickly and things do arrive at the warehouse within a week or even sometimes a few days. A week later, my Tamagotchi Uni is now in the Bai warehouse. Bai will show you how many free storage period days you have left for every item you've purchased. Having the 30 day free storage period means that instead of buying something online and shipping it immediately to your door like you normally would, you are now able to keep on shopping from many different vendors, have all your purchases accumulated at the Bayi warehouse and ship all your shopping in one package to save on shipping fees. So I actually bought something else after I bought my Tamagotchi Uni. Here you can see that I'm consolidating the two items I bought into one single package to ship to my door. Consolidating packages at Bayi is completely free of charge and you can pay an extra fee to 
add protective packaging to your goodies. This is completely optional, but I like to do this because I want to make sure my collectibles arrive in perfect condition. So here I'm just going to select add both. It might take a few days for Baiyi to consolidate all the packages, but once that's done, you'll be able to choose which shipping courier to go with. I love that Baiyi offers many different options. Usually if I want to receive things really quickly, I go with DHL. All the prices and ETA are very clearly listed on every single option. Just choose the one you want, pay for it and you're all done. It's been around two weeks since I had my order shipped and it arrived today. Very early this morning, the parcel arrived at my door. Inside here is my Tamagotchi Uni as well as another Tamagotchi I got for my collection. Let's open this up. I'm so excited. I've been seeing so many people playing with a Uni online. I'm just getting FOMO. Here's my uni. They wrapped it up like a Christmas gift. This is so cute. And the other item is just another Tamagotchi and Tama I got for myself. I'll show you guys this in my next collection video. I'm so excited because this has been on my wish list for a few years. But let's go back to the uni. We have a lot to cover about the uni. I'm gonna unwrap this now. So cute! So glad I got this Japanese version because the box is so tiny which is really good for someone like me who's a collector because I already have a lot of Tamagotchis. I need things that are storage friendly. As you can see it says Wi-Fi here which is one of the biggest things about this Tamagotchi. This is the first ever Tamagotchi model that supports Wi-Fi which means you can play games on it with people around the world because your device will be connected online. This is what the box looks like. Oh my god! And one really really cool thing about getting this from Baiyi through like a Japanese seller is that a lot of these sellers will also give you this Tamaverse passport and these passports will come with this sticker here. There are many different types of stickers and on this sticker is a download code for special items. And for this sticker, because it says accessories on the top with the little suitcase, this sticker has the downloadable code for the suitcase accessory. And and these passcodes can only be used three times. If you want to keep the users to yourself, be careful when you share pictures of these stickers online because people can use your passcode. And let's have a look at the passport. I'm very intrigued. I have no idea what it looks like inside. Here it is. Inside it, you get these little grids. I guess you put this sticker on as a means to collect them all. But seeing how many squares they give you, I'm like, are there really that many stickers? This is just an extra cute thing to collect. I'm so glad I got the Kuchipachi one. This was the one I wanted. I don't think I would use any of the codes on these stickers. I just don't want users taken out of them. I don't know, maybe I will, I'll see. And now let's open this up and have a look. And just to give you an idea, of how big the US version is for the Tamagotchi Uni packaging. This is the US version. It is massive. It's not like there's anything on the bottom compartment of the box either. I think it's just the instruction booklet and the charging cable. This is the Japanese version in comparison. So I'll be only opening the Japanese version today and let's see what it looks like. And here it is. The colors are so cute. The size itself is very similar to Tamagotchi Smart. And it comes with this tiny, tiny charging cable. I swear this is even shorter than the one they give you for the Tamagotchi Smart. Why do they make it so small? And I'm just gonna take the watch out of the packaging now. There's a little piece of plastic covering it, protecting it. And oh my God, it's so shiny. Oh, the back is transparent. I love when Tamagotchis have transparent shells because you can kind of like see the motherboard, the batteries. It just looks very cool, you know? All right, you know the drill. I'm going to put a screen protector on now and then we can start playing with it. And just like the Tamagotchi smartwatches, according to the instructions, it recommends that you charge your watch for around two hours for a full charge. From the experience of other collectors, I've heard that sometimes if you charge your watches overnight, it does kind of damage your battery and that affects your battery life. I'm not sure how easy it is for you to damage your battery to that extent, but I'm not going to risk it. So I'm just going to charge my watch for around two hours and that should be enough for 
for me to run the watch for a good few days. Now, before I pop the toy out of this wristband, let me just show you what it looks like worn as a watch. This is what it looks like. My wrist is on the small side. In my opinion, it's way too bulky to be worn as a watch for me. It just looks really silly when I have it on. Hang on, let me give you a better picture. This is what it looks like. I mean, it's definitely functional as a watch. The screen is quite big. The material of this watch band is different from the Tamagotchi Smart. The silicone on the Tamagotchi Smart is like more matte and smooth. This one has more resistance when you touch it. If this was like a hot day and you use this, it would definitely stick to your skin. Don't love this material, but I'm not going to use it as a watch, so I'm not mad about it. And I'm just popping it out of the wristband now. And you do that by just very lightly pushing it out from the back just like that the size is honestly just like the tamagotchi smart the back looks so cool unlike the tamagotchi smart this tamagotchi actually has three functional buttons the tamagotchi smart only has one button but then it has a touch screen i personally like the buttons i don't know the touch screen was a bit annoying for me sometimes especially when i'm playing it through like a protective case sometimes it can be hard to detect my finger movement and all that kind of stuff so i'm glad the button are back. First, you'll have to pick what language you want your Tamagotchi to be in. I love this about the Tamagotchi Uni. This language setting function is another thing you can't do on the Tamagotchi Smart. I did get a lot of questions on my Tamagotchi Smart video asking if you can set the language on the smartwatch in English. The answer to that is no. The Tamagotchi Smart only comes in Japanese, meaning if you want to get a Tamagotchi watch in English, the Tamagotchi Uni is the way to go. So let's go ahead and set English as our language and I'm just going to quickly set the date and time and now it says pick date order on clock screen okay oh in Australia we read our date like this nickname let's go with Maury as usual are you sure yes I'm sure and birthday just gonna quickly set that up as well. Pick where your Tamagotchi lives. Ooh, this is new. So there's Tama Japan, Tama North America, Tama Latin America, Tama Europe, Tama Asia, Tama Middle East, Tama Oceania, and Tama Africa. Let's just go with this one because I'm in Australia. Here, okay? Yes. Set up Wi Fi. Now that's a first. I've never had to set Wi Fi on a Tamagotchi device before. That's amazing. By device. And it'll start searching for the Wi Fi network. Let me just quickly set this up. Wi Fi password has been entered in. Now it's connecting. And the point of having Wi-Fi on this device is that you can join online events. I'm so excited for this. Just comparing this to the very first Tamagotchi I got when I was nine. What a huge technology upgrade. <laughs> and now it says select an egg. I love this. I love all the choices that we get to make. Let's go with a green egg. Green is my favorite color. This is so cool. Now we're just waiting for it to hatch. Heads up, this Tamagotchi is loud. I'm pretty sure you can change the volume though, so I might turn it down a little bit when I can do that. It's hatching. It takes around. Oh my god, it's so cute. I've never seen this character before. He's like a blob. Ooh, so the menu page looks like this now. And just following that little cursor there, I'm just being directed to feed my pet. Oh my god, he's so adorable. There's also the snack option, which allows you to give your pet a cookie. The foods are exactly the same as some of the other Tamagotchi devices. It always starts with like a milk bottle and a cookie. And there's also a delivery option that's currently grayed out. I'm sure we can access that when the pet is a bit older. So that's the toilet and bathroom option. Let's try bath and see what that looks like. Oh. Oh my god. 
that was adorable. Why are you still sad? So you can see my pet's not hungry, but not very happy and we're very poor. So under settings is where you can control the brightness and the sound of your Tamagotchi. No, you can't turn it down. All right, I'll keep it on for now. And he's sick. Now he's better. So the cursor is showing up on the screen again. Oh, you got a care icon. Flushed poo, count one. That's interesting. So there are care goals on this Tamagotchi. Is this where I can see my poo medal? Yay! The care icons are more like achievements. I'm excited to see what the other ones are because, oh my god, there's a lot to collect. It would be really cool to be able to get all of these. Yes, he's still really sad. Let's figure out how to make him happier. Items. Oh, so we have a cleaning robot that's free and a rattle. The rattle should do it. Oh my god, it's so loud. Let's try the robot vacuum. There's not much I can do right now because he's still a baby. As you can see, most things are grayed out. I love that there's a sitter option though, by the way. Definitely need that when I have a busy day of work. I hate when my Tamagotchis die when I'm too busy, then I have to start all over again every single time. I'll be back when he's a toddler. Usually it takes around an hour for little baby Tamagotchis to grow into a toddler. And during this time, just make sure that your toddler is, you know, really happy, not hungry. You clean all their poos then you should be able to raise a good care character. Oh, he's about to poo. Yay. Nice, we just unlocked another care icon. Why are you sad again? I'm just gonna feed this guy and I'll see you guys again in an hour. My Tamagotchi just transformed into the cutest thing in the whole entire world. He looks like a Furby. This is a new character. I've never seen him before. There's also a little poo at the back. Let's clean that up. Now that my little Bibi is a toddler, I can do a lot more. Let's explore the Tamagotchi Uni a bit more. Let's take a look at his status. Oh, it's a bit hungry. And now we have 300 Gotchi points because you always get some money when you transform. Let's take a look at profile. What does Rash mean? Anyway, his name is Wellkochi. And I've noticed that if you press the middle button here, it takes you to edit and send phone so let's check that out let's start with edit so this is where you can edit your name and icon oh so you can display your care achievements but so far my achievements are all like poo and toilet related hmm. <laughs> i guess i don't have a choice this does not look cute the other one is send phone that makes no sense just reading it so let's see what it means scan the code with your smartphone to connect device to your phone okay let's check that out we've got the qr code let's do this Oh, so now my phone is connected to the Wi-Fi on the Tamagotchi. Send an image from your device to your smartphone. Okay, let's try that again. Loving how all the latest models of Tamagotchis incorporate QR code. <gasps> oh my God, you can send this screen to your phone. So that's what send phone means. Oh, that's awesome. And from your phone, you can save it, I guess. <gasps> that's really, really cute. Especially like for collectors who have like a Tamagotchi social media page. This is really, really fun. With the food icon, now that our pet is a bit older, let's see what food they eat. So, ooh, cereal. So from the baby bottle, the food turns into a cereal with the snack. You get jelly beans. Oh, that's so cool. I don't think I've ever seen jelly beans on Tamagotchis before. Now the delivery icon is no longer grayed out. Let's see what this is about. 
You can get food delivery. Oh my god, is that some get tongue? And then there's dim sum, hamburger, steamed egg, veggie sticks, fur, lobster sub. One of the biggest selling points of the Tamagotchi Uni, like even with all the pre-order ads and all the trailer ads about the Tamagotchi Uni, is that there's this international world theme. It features a lot of different cultures from around the world. Let's check out the snacks. So you can get red bean sweets, cherry pie, mango shaved ice. Oh, that's so cute. It's like bingsu. Shaved ice, kiwi, Canale, chocolate, popcorn, apple pie, donuts, green tea, and that's it. That's so cool. Let's try getting one thing delivered. I'm curious to see what the animation for delivery is like. Let's go with some kiwis. Oh, you can buy three at once. This is really handy because sometimes when I want to buy a few of the same foods, I don't have to keep buying the same thing over and over, which is a bit annoying. But here we go. Purchase made. Wait for delivery. Let's wait for our kiwi delivery. Oh! <gasps> Can you guys hear that? You sounded like an Animal Crossing character. <laughs> that was so cute. Let's feed the kiwi to our little Furby boy. Okay, moving on. Let's check out what this phone icon is. Oh, so it's still grayed out. And the only function you can access is the sitters icon, which is your babysitter. But we don't need that right now because we're still playing with a toy. And then I assume this is internet. Go to Tamaverse. Yes, let's check Tamaverse out. Tamaverse is another huge thing about the Tamagotchi Uni. Those are the new Tamagotchi Uni characters. That shark character is so popular. I think I can't go there yet. What's this place? Oh, am I at an airport? So let me give you more context before I keep exploring the Tamaverse. Basically, Tamaverse is kind of like the app for the Tamagotchi Uni. When we had the Tamagotchi Meets back in the days, we had an actual phone app where we can interact with other players online through that app. But because we can actually use Wi-Fi on this device now, there's no need for an extra app on a phone. And Tamaverse was another main selling point of the Tamagotchi Uni. Through Tamaverse, not only can you meet other players, Sometimes there are also Tamaverse events where you can participate in games and win rewards that are exclusive to the Tamaverse events. I had missed the very first event that happened like a few weeks ago. I saw all of these collectors participating in the really amazing racing games on Tamaverse and people who did really well at the event won all sorts of prizes, things like accessories for your Tamagotchis. It really adds to the gameplay of the Tamagotchi and there's almost always something to look forward to because because who knows what will happen in the next few months on Tamaverse. Who knows what kind of new events Bandai will release. There's just a lot of potential for new fun things to happen for the Tamagotchi Uni because it has access to Wi-Fi. Let's go back to Tamaverse and explore it further. Here's the animation again. And you know what? Now that I'm listening to it more, the way they talk, like the gibberish talking sounds that they're making right now, I don't know if you can hear it. That, like that sound. All the Tamagotchi characters spoke like that on the Tamagotchi DS games. If you've played the DS games, that's how all of them talked. I can appreciate that they kept that feature on the Tamagotchi Uni. Okay, let's explore what you can do on here now. This was the airport place that we were just at. Welcome to Tama Travel. Choose any tour you want. So you can go on tours around the world. Here's the desert. You can see a pyramid there. There must be Egypt. Water city. Tropical Island, Aurora Village. That is so cool, but I'm broke right now. I have like, what, 200 gotchi points? So I can't do that yet. We'll come back to that. And then we've got this place here. It must be an accessories shop or something because there's a hat on that building. Welcome to Tama Fashion Buy. Oh, Tama Fashion. <laughs> Buy accessories from around the world and display your own outfit. That's cool. But again, I'm so broke. I don't know if I can afford anything. Ooh, look at all of these hats and accessories. I don't think I can afford any of these. That's 
Gozaru cheese outfit from Tama Japan. Purchase? I don't have the money. So if you don't have enough money and you press yes, They'll say sorry not enough money we'll definitely be buying a set of these very soon because they are so cool here at the arena it's all fenced off it says tama arena so we can't access those don't worry we'll have more to explore as we go for now tamaverse looks really cool to me i can't wait to join the next tamaverse event and now after the tamaverse icon there's our items icon but because we haven't bought anything We've only got the two things. Oh, and the rattle has now turned into building blocks. I noticed there's a crafts icon. So this must mean we can make things on this Tamagotchi. And then there's the going out icon. Let's see what this is. There's Tama Mall, Arcade and Tama Walk. Let's check out Tama Mall first. Welcome to Tama Mall. Oh, I love how they talk. This is just like the DS game. Oh, you can sell things now. I guess that's a way to make more gotchi points and you can buy items, accessories, furniture and wallpapers for your room. So let's check out items first. Is that a dolphin floaty? That's adorable. You can also get a boomerang, rugby ball, rocking horse, fossils. Mm, interesting. Bread maker. That's so cool. Microphone, sauna stove. So many new items. And then we've got the accessories. We have the snorkel set. I've seen the snorkel set before, but it looked a bit, a bit different on the other Tamagotchi model. There's a scuba tank, opal earrings, ukulele, and a cool hat. Oh, fire torch, sauna hat, sweat. <laughs> That's so funny. Pillow, mask, sunglasses steam <laughs> you can wear sweat and steam as an accessory and then there's furniture oh a full palm tree i guess these are furnitures you can put in your living room or like living space inner tube and ball why do they call them inner tubes shell chair oh i like this one jellyfish lamp fancy desk and chair arcade machine blue chair flamingo and plants heart sofa pattern dresser now let's check out the wallpapers you can get for your living space Ooh, nautical. This looks really cool. And then we've got the coral reef, nice. I love anything ocean themed for the Tamagotchi. Cyber, not a big fan of this one. Fluffy, I think I've seen this. Like there was a very, very similar one on the Tamagotchi meets. Flamingo, street, black and white, space, rainbow. Definitely have seen this on the Tamagotchi meets. Outdoor, ooh. <laughs> Is that a fish? Looks like he's drowning. Wood room, heartful, minimalistic, unique, patterns, nature. It's not uncommon for Tamagotchis to recycle old content. Sometimes it's just nice to see some of like my old favorites appear on new models. So I'm not mad about that. Next we have the arcade. Let's check out what games you can get on the Tamagotchi Uni. Earn gotchi points by playing lots of games. Yes, we need gotchi points. So we've got three games. The first game is called Dancing. I have no idea how to play these games. So this is very similar to the Tamagotchi Smart. It's a motion sensing game. So I don't have it on. <laughs> we look so funny. I don't have it on as a watch, but we can still play it like this. Okay. All right, so I think I need to follow the motion a bit more accurately. We'll try our best. Okay. Oh no, did I miss it? I did, okay. We will do better this time. Was it like this? <laughs> what am I doing? <laughs> no. Oh, I still get 10 gotchi points. On the Tamagotchi Smart, it was a lot easier. You just had to shake your Tamagotchi Smart and that did the job, but obviously it didn't work on the uni. Second game is fast food. What's going on? What do I do? Serve food to customers. Okay. This feels chaotic. What do I do? Oh, no, no, no. So whoever's done reading the menu, just shove them a burger. They only serve burgers here. Oh, that was a lot easier than the first game. Yay. Let's see how many gotchi points we get. 300, nice. We're one step closer to getting some sweat. And the third game is best photo. Aw, starry night. What do I do? Take 
a well-timed photo. All right, so we have to stop the arrow indicator in the red zone. The arrow does go faster and faster. Cute, that was fun. I liked the last two games. Okay, let's check out Tama Walk. Ooh, you can choose where you wanna take your walk. Fun. So Tama Walk is very interesting because you actually have to walk with your Tamagotchi in order for this to work. Say for example, I pick C as my walking venue. Welcome, enjoy your walk. Once you've picked your venue, you'll be given 20 minutes to complete your walk. And in these 20 minutes, your Tamagotchi will sense whether you're walking or not because it's got motion sensing. Obviously, I'm not walking right now because I'm filming a video, but you can also walk by just, you know, shaking your Tamagotchi. That also works. If you're using this in public though, I would recommend turning the sound off because it will keep beeping like this until the screen turns off, of course. And once you've walked enough, you'll be rewarded a craft recipe. And with this recipe, you can use the crafting function that was grayed out just now that we saw. I'm gonna try do like a 20 minute walk now just to show you what it looks like because I also am very curious as to what it is. 10 minutes into walking with it, the bar is half filled. While I was walking, I was also like just reading online how people do this walk and I read that you don't actually have to walk the full 20 minutes to get rewarded with things. You can also just let it sit, but I guess depending on how much you walk, you get different rewards, but we're doing pretty good actually. The things that you get rewarded through Tama Walk are crafting materials as well as DIY recipes. That's really, really cool. It really encourages you to walk more and we've got eight minutes 30 left i'm gonna keep walking now talk to you later well three and a half minutes left and the bar is full so you don't actually need to keep turning the screen on for this to work when the screen shuts off just keep walking everything proceeds as normal yeah so when it does that just keep walking it's fine the time of walk is still in progress i can't wait to see what rewards we got and the walk is completed we have a shell backpack DIY, that's so cool. And we also got a bunch of craft materials. These are probably the things we need to craft the backpack. I'm not sure. We've also got a care icon. Let's check out crafting since we now have a DIY as well as some craft materials. So the crafts icon is no longer grayed out. Now you'll see that we have one DIY and in order to craft this we need two seashells and three pigments depending on what color you want i need some of these pigments in order to craft my shell backpack in order to get more craft materials you need to go on another walk so i'll be doing a lot of walking this week i guess so the next icon to explore is the connect icon unfortunately with the tamagotchi uni even though it has a wi-fi function you can only connect with friends locally so your friend has to be physically next to you to connect so I can't really try this out yet unless I unbox my other Tamagotchi Uni however if you do use the Tamaverse on Tamaverse through Tama Party you can meet other users Tamagotchis for a chance to marry them so that's really cool I think the Wi-Fi is more for accessing Tamaverse getting downloadable content and stuff like that the last icon we have yet to explore is this Wi-Fi icon here and this is where you can update your information, change your settings as well as download new updates for your Tamagotchi Uni. Here you can download items and all sorts of fun things using codes and there are a lot of rewards that you can find on the Tamagotchi official website as well as from the Tamagotchi guidebooks and from those stickers that I showed you earlier in this video. You can also update the software on this Tamagotchi. I just read online that there is actually a new update and this update will allow you to adjust the volume of the sound and not just turn it on and off. So let's do that now because it is so loud and it's so loud it's driving me a little nuts. <laughs> to do that, you just go update and check for new updates just go yes for checking for new updates it'll then use the wi-fi function so yes let's do the update and let's see what happens 
So the update is done. That took a little while. I don't know if it's because my Wi-Fi is slow. Now that it's been officially updated, let's change the sound settings. Under settings. That's amazing! You can now adjust the volume of your Tamagotchi Uni. This was exactly what I needed. So every now and then, just hop on the Tamagotchi official website. If there is a software update available, just go ahead and do what I just did and download the latest update. I also noticed that on the Tamagotchi official website, there are some downloadable items available and it'll tell you in what period it is available. It looks like I can still download these two items and you should be able to do that through that Wi-Fi icon we just had a look at so under info go onto the renew info option and you'll be shown to the connecting page once it's done it'll say new info is here and you'll see new content downloaded onto your device so it says there's new mail and new gift for me and on the gift we should be able to find these two items that we just saw on the Tamagotchi website so I'm very excited and there we have it the shaved eyes machine and the cone hat we also get 3,000 gotchi points, that's awesome! Let's get the shaved ice machine first. It's summer, you can make shaved ice with this machine. Check your item, push the A button. So here's our gift. There's also the cone hat. Let's get the cone hat. An ice cream landed on your head. It's a cone hat, check your accessories. All right, push the A button again. It will go straight to your item box. Let's check out the shaved ice machine we just got. That looked really cool. It's just under item. You'll find it here. You have the option to either use it or place it. I guess place means putting it in the background, the backdrop of your living space, but let's use it for now. That was so cute. He accidentally made too much shaved ice. And let's see if we can use the accessories already. On some Tamagotchi models, you can't really use accessories until you're an adult character. It looks like you can. Oh, that's so cute. Love it. Definitely check out the Tamagotchi official website every now and then. That makes me really excited to see what there is to come. It's only been two hours into me running this and I'm absolutely loving it already. Now that we've gotten through all the icons, let's look at the watch face. Don't forget that this is a watch, I keep forgetting. So if you do wear this out as a watch and you want to access like the watch face, see what time it is, all you have to do is hold on to the first button here on the left. The watch face will pop up. You'll also be able to choose different types of watch faces and you'll also be able to see the battery status of your Tamagotchi Uni. There are four different designs to choose from. I personally like this one the best. As I play this throughout the week, I'll be getting more Gotchi points and I'll be trying out more of the new items and accessories. So keep watching for a Tamagotchi Uni vlog. Fingers crossed I don't kill it. I'll also update you guys on the battery live by the end of the week.
My Tamagotchi just transformed into a teenage character. This is what he looks like. He's so cute. Sorry, I've got some paint on my finger. I'm painting right now. Let's see what his name is. So his name is Kuririchi. He looks like a little teddy bear. Tomorrow should be the day my Tamagotchi turns into the adult character. So far, I'm loving it. It's very easy to take care of. It doesn't get sick very easily. And I only feed it like once every hour or two. And he remains happy, which is really good. I also started decorating his living space a little bit more. I have the dolphin floaty at the back here and some artwork displayed at the back. And here we have the face massager. Let's see what it does. Oh no, he hates it! Every Tamagotchi character will have their preferred item, accessories. They all like different things. That's another really fun thing about Tamagotchis. You have to race every single pet differently. So today is the third day into running my Tamagotchi uni. Also, I forgot to put him under the care of the babysitter. So let's see if he's dead. <laughs> Hopefully not. And let's see what adult character we got. <gasps> we got Mamechi! Oh, he's really sad right now. And he's pooped at the back of the room. Mamechi is usually like a perfect or like a good care character. Oh my god, look how sassy he is. He's pissed at me. Let's go ahead and feed him that special margarita pizza we got from traveling. Hopefully that cheers him up a little bit. Now that we have reached the adult stage, let's check out that locked venue on Tamaverse that we haven't explored yet. I think this is the party mode. And now we can enter. We couldn't before when we were younger. Go to party, yes. Attending. Date one. <laughs> I love how they word things. Yeah, let's go on a date with someone. She looks really cute. Oh, <laughs> is that the steam accessory? That's so cute. Date. Oh, it's a Japanese style date. Oh no, don't propose. We don't want to get married yet. Okay to leave? Yes. Oh, that was really cute. There's definitely a lot of new characters, new jingle, new items, new features on the Tamagotchi Uni, which is nice because a lot of times Tamagotchis like to recycle old content. I also want to mention that I bought the new Tamagotchi Uni guidebook. This book is in Japanese, but it's really cool because it gives you a lot of useful insights as to how you can care for your characters as well as how you get specific characters. I feel like this book is pretty useful even if you don't know Japanese. A lot of the instructions come with pictures so it's pretty self-explanatory. It's really cute because the book has like these little comics as well and it also comes with a very detailed character guide. And on the character guide it very clearly shows you how you can get certain characters. Some of the new characters are honestly so adorable. And since we got Mamechi, you can go on the page about Mamechi and you'll find out everything that he likes. So it seems like these are some of his his favorite foods and snacks. Let's try this out. Let's try get some of his favorite things. So even if you don't know how to read the Japanese characters, you can really just match up the icons, match up the pictures, and you can make it work, you know. So it seems like this red bean sweets is one of his favorite foods, and so is the green tea. Let's try out the green tea. Yay! Another really cool thing about this guidebook is that not only does it have a guide to all the existing characters of the Tamagotchi, it also has like an items and accessories and food and snacks guide. And there's also a page showing you all the care icons that you can get. One of the coolest things about this book is that it includes four downloadable codes that is exclusive to the Tamagotchi Uni guidebook. And unlike these DLC stickers that you get, which which only gives you a limited three uses. The downloadable codes on the guidebook are unlimited and I believe some collectors have already shared the codes online but I'm just going to share them here as well so you don't have to look for them. So if you want to download these accessories 
the code is just up here just pause on the screen or screenshot and you can download the different accessories we've got this book accessory here and then there's a graduation hat accessory also the glasses and there's like comet star themed accessory that goes around your potty it looks really cool in order to download the accessories with these codes it's very easy you just have to go to this wi-fi connection icon here go download and go input code let's try get the glasses it's quite a long code so this will take a while Now that we have the code inputted in, we should get the glasses. Yay! We, have we can access those in our accessories folder. Let's go put them on now. And they're his favorite. I'm the type who likes to go on walks every day. <laughs> I think he's encouraging me to go on the Tama walk. I really like when he closes his eyes like that. And in terms of battery life, we're still on full bar, three days in. So this is my fourth day running my Tamagotchi Uni and I was just at the arcade trying to earn some gotchi points and I realized that there's a new game. Dancing and fast food we've already tried before, but matching is new. So let's check that out. I believe it's just a very simple matching game. You just got to remember what's under the leaves and then match them up. And if you get the worm, you instantly lose. So we learned something new today. The farm location on Tama Walk is a really good place for you to farm materials. Let's try it again and see if we can get more. Now we've got a bunch of materials. I think from the farm game, we have enough of the orange pigments to craft this orange shell backpack. I feel like doing the pink one, let's do that. So just select create to confirm you wanna craft this item. To put on the backpack that we just crafted, go to accessories, a bunch of materials, and you'll be able to find the shell backpack oh my god it's huge oh he loves it very curious as to what other diys there are is he just playing with the toilet lid oh my god did we just get the pro care icon so it's officially a week into running my tamagotchi uni now i just put a sleeping hat on mamechi he looks so cute i think it's time to marry him off usually i would keep him for a bit longer but i just want to show you guys how that works i'm just popping over to tamaverse now we can hop over to tama party it's the place where they socialize oh my god so just pressing yes to go to party and now I get to choose who to date. I really love this first character here. Let's go with her. Now they're on a date. And it'll ask whether you want to propose. Just say yes, because we do want to marry him off. Are you sure? Yes. And Amechi goes, will you live with me? <laughs> this is so cute. Yay. And now we have the wedding. I always love the wedding scenes because you get to see all the characters. Ah, oh, this is so cool. Oh, I love that. We've also unlocked a new care icon and now we wait for the next generation to hatch. So that's it for this video. I hope you found this video helpful or 
entertaining at least. I really enjoy doing these Tamagotchi videos for you guys and thank you so much Baiyi for sponsoring this video. Because you guys have shown my Tamagotchi videos so much support, I'm now getting sponsors and when I get sponsored it means I can make more content like this for you guys. It also means a lot that I'm collaborating with a company that I genuinely like and do use. So thank you again for showing my collection so much love and make sure you guys check Baiyi out. There is a coupon link in the description box for first time Baiyi users. Make sure you check that out and just give Baiyi a go and find your dream Tamagotchis. Happy shopping! I'll talk to you guys again very soon and just stay on for a few seconds. I'm gonna give you a sneak peek of which adult character I got for the second generation.